Hi guys, Ali here. Um, I'm just back to share with you my September design team project for Ephemera's Vintage Garden. And um, this month we're using the Summer's End um, journal kit. And um, I'll put the link below because if you head over to Ephemera's Vintage Garden during the month of September you'll find that this kit is on offer um, with 30% discount so um, it's an ideal time to buy if you, if you like what you see here um, as you see this is one of the printables um, the scaling of it is pretty much for a um, traveller's notebook Midori style um, journal although next month I'm going to try and do something a bit different this month I've actually gone for the this type of um, journal as you will see here so um, I've made the cover and um, added some uh, lace over the um, bind like the, the binding as it were some buttons and um, some scrapbook paper here and this is one of the beautiful images from the kit and then I've actually put one of the metal embellishments and the word journal that I've stamped there and I've used some um, uh, of the Rangers glossy accent in the the one that cracks um, so I don't know if you can see that added a little charm and some lace and I've done some I don't know if it picks it up but some mach machine stitching around this image here as well so that's the back and um, we will go inside so inside I've actually inside of the cover I've used a um, paper napkin serviette whatever you want to call it and um, because that actually went really well with the collection um, so I thought that would be really nice to have as the inside of the cover and I've also made this pocket here and then in the pocket I've added some of the um, journaling spots and things from the collection these are little file folders that um, were a freebie actually a part of the collection so I've added some of those thought they'd be good for putting little notes on and that um, this is another one of the beautiful images similar to that I've used on the front cover but just in a different colorway you also can get some um, tags part of the collection and you get a lot of um, little words so I've added them in and as I say the kit's called Summer's End so I cut that out and put that in there as well so they've been left in the pocket just to add as the journal gets used so that's those and then the, I've actually um, put three booklets in here um, one of them is an altered booklet which you'll see as we go and two of them are actually fully made using the kit so the first one is one of the fully made ones and that's one of the beautiful papers and then on the inside of that I've added um, another one of the free file folder um, pieces to create a little tuck spot and then there's another of the tags and another of the um, journaling pieces and then you have um, as part part of the kit you can purchase um, the actual um, planner pages so this is um, oh no sorry this is actually um, within the kit that you, you can buy um, and this is just the blank and then this is the planner add-on kit that you can get so it all matches and this is um, a week on two pages so that's really sweet and then what I've done in the middle where I've bound it I've just added a couple of butterflies to the, the strings of the binding and they're just cut from um, a, a scrap of the paper where I've over printed more than I needed so that's that journal 
and that's the back of the um, image and then for the altered book this is just a grid book just a normal plain grid book that I've already had so I've actually added one of the um, images to the front of the cover and then um, used the freebie file folder to create another pocket, another tag um, and journaling spot and then <coughs> oh, excuse me, I've added um, a page um, from the kit and I've just washi taped it in and then every few pages I've added and it just breaks the plainness of the journal up so that's throughout the journal just added them as, as extras to the so it helps it all to tie in so I thought that was quite cute so that's that one and then the final one that I've done um, is another completely made journal and this is another one of the beautiful papers from the kit and yet again I've used the file folder to create a little tuck spot with a couple of bits in there and then we've got lined paper and that is part of the uh, planner kit add-on that you can get and then we've got some just plain grid, grid paper and that comes part of the main kit and then we've got um, a month to view so that's like that and yet again I've added some little butterflies in the centre of that so and that's your lined paper again so I've added, that's the beauty of being able to print them yourself because you can mix and match it how you want and then I've created a pocket at the back here and I've added um, these journaling cards that come as part of the main kit I think they're repl replica postcards so really lovely and these little and you'll notice that everything comes in the three color ways so that's really nice because you can actually you could if you want do um, three journals a red one a um, terracotta one and a teal one and then add the bits that matched um, to, so you could just kind of colour code your journals for whatever you want or you know however you, you feel so that's that's really good option to have with the kit so that's my um, kit uh, my journal or my planner that I've created this month and um, I hope you like it as I say head over to um, Ephemeris Vintage Garden to have a look if you want to purchase the kit and um, hopefully next month I'll be back again um, with the same kit but a completely different idea so see you then thank you bye <laughs>